Hey, did you see uh, Bros? <laughs> no, I haven't seen Bros. <laughs> Sadly, I, see I, see <laughs> no, I don't think anybody did. I think that's why I did so bad in the box office. <laughs> it just it didn't. It bothered me. Not. It just bothers me to think that anyone's obligated to see any movie. You know. Yeah. Especially yeah. to pay um, for it in a theater. Like, get mad if no one watches it when it comes out on TV. But yeah, that's what it was. I think I saw something that was just like, you know, the reason why the movie didn't do well is because, uh, you know, they said America's homophobic. And I'm like, yes, yes. Just like, um, like, yo, you, exactly. That's just like saying, like, man, the reason why, you know, we keep having trouble with black people in America is America's racist. It's like, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Adapt. Right. <laughs> Adapt. That's. So yeah, I don't I don't know about the movie at all. Um, you know, I I don't know any of the details in the movie. I mean, obviously it was pitched as a gay movie, but I feel like uh what's that movie? Uh not Bruno. I guess Bruno. That Bruno, was a oh yeah, the Sasha gay Baron movie that did well. Yeah. Huh? It's yeah. if if the movie's good, um people go see it. I think the problem is they marketed it as a historic important event because it was the first uh like all gay rom-com made by a big studio and nobody wants to do anything important or have to go somewhere because they feel like it's a historically important like nobody cares that much anymore especially about movies right we've got importance fatigue don't we right. I, I, I agree i'm like i'm like why couldn't they just have made a movie like like if the main whatever i don't know the main character's name is right but let's just say if it's greg right why couldn't it just be a movie called greg's life and you watch right. the movie, and it's just you know Greg happens to be gay, and goes through these issues, you know. But yeah, you're right. They, you're right. They're making it seem like it's like a like this is pivotal, and it's like, well, I want to be entertained. Um, yeah. I know. I told my friend, I was like, why can't they just make a movie about? Uh, why can't they just make a movie of a, 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 a funny movie? No, a good like a, a biopic type of movie about a, a gay person with, like who's interested or something. He's like, they already did it. Uh, he goes, Bohemian Rhapsody. I was like, <laughs> that's, <laughs> I was, that's stupid. <laughs> that is kind of true. Uh, you want to go see it later? No, but um, <clears throat> I actually think it's a good time to announce that I'm making a movie. It's called uh, Niggas. Uh, <laughs> and it's about the important uh, importance of black people that's in fair. America. And I demand that every white person watch this movie. And I, I will be there. I don't know how I'm going to ask for the ticket when I show up at the movie theater. I'll just have to point to the screen and say that one. But, um, and the Jewish media better support. <laughs> no, the Jewish media better fund this movie. They better like this movie. God <laughs> but, damn it. But I can't make this movie and then be surprised when at mass they're not enjoying it. You know, that's, And that's just, that's, uh, let's just, let's take all of the, uh, political chargeness out of it you know it's it's just not the best piece of advertisement that's all honestly your idea not a bad idea for like a youtube parody of the whole situation <laughs> oh man i got a bunch of those man i'm gonna do white slavery i'm gonna do uh <laughs> I I got, oh i got a list of those <laughs> oh, i love that uh i'm, I'm also fighting for the alopecia community community uh, community um you know is that right you know, just awareness yeah man because do you do you have that Oh boy, do I! <laughs> you do. I can't hey, what are you doing? Ah. It doesn't look that way. Can I zoom in more? Let me see. <laughs> yo, yo, this is discrimination, sir. Were you <laughs> offended? Did you want to slap? <laughs> Did you want to slap was... Chris Rock after that awful joke? Yes, I wanted to slap Chris Rock. I also wanted to slap Will Smith. I want to yeah. slap everybody. This is a travesty. But no, um. <laughs> No, I, I did think that was interesting. It was an interesting way to bring awareness to an issue. You know, when you when you have alopecia, does it piss you off when LeBron James gets like hairline implants? Because he was going that way, and then yeah. he added in some stuff in the front, and uh, Jeremy Piven too, I think. Yeah, and it's like, hey guys, you're cheating. No, no, Stand that's the with whole us. game. No, 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 no. That's the whole. That's part of it. See, you're discriminating. See, look, <laughs> everybody's at different stages of their hair loss, okay? Right. And how they choose to deal with it. <laughs> so My girlfriend okay. insists that I'm constantly in a, in a stage of it. You know, I have this like widow's peak that uh -huh. makes it look like I'm losing my hair, but it's looked the same thin hair. It's like that horrible thin white hair that, uh, oh man, you got like the this super, for years. 
You got the Superman curl. You'll be all right. Yeah. <laughs> That's the Superman curl. You're good. For now. <laughs> For now. Yeah.